This morning, two Russian cosmonauts are preparing to venture outside the International Space Station. They're hoping to finish the work that began last year. Elaine Gahano shows us how they plan to give the world a new look. Elaine, good morning. Good morning to you, Nora. One month ago, a mission to set up these high-definition cameras was halted due to a technical malfunction. If today's spacewalk is successful, the company behind the venture plans to stream high-definition video of the Earth for everyone to see. Are you getting the picture, Sergey? On December 27th, two Russian cosmonauts spent over eight hours in outer space. Okay, I put the cover on. No. Their mission was to attach two high-definition cameras to the Russian module of the International Space Station. But after bolting the cameras in place, ground crews failed to receive a signal, bringing the mission to a disappointing end. Oleg, you should be probably the first one to go back. A month later, the Canadian company behind the venture says it's confident their cameras are ready. It'll be a six or seven hour spacewalk. Uh, they'll hook the cameras in, uh, they'll plug in data, plug in power. Scott Larson is the CEO of Earthcast. Larson spent over two years developing the technology in partnership with the Russian Space Agency. We give the Russians the cameras. They provide the launch, the installation, the downlink. We split the data. They take the data of Russia. We take the data of the rest of the world. Once installed, the cameras are expected to stream high-definition images of the Earth from 250 miles above the ground. The station is moving in this direction here. So the space station orbits the Earth every 90 minutes, and these cameras could offer a new vantage point, capturing everything from natural disasters to social upheaval. It could be people are organizing or is a demonstration going on, and you'll be able to fly over and, and uh, take those videos. The company plans to stream the images online 24 hours a day, seven days a week. We'll be putting pictures out online that frankly no one's ever seen before. And then the goal is to build that into a community, get people involved, overlay content on there that is useful so that people come back all the time. The company says it has more than $20 million in contracts to distribute the footage it captures from outer space. If today's spacewalk is successful, the cameras could be online in a matter of weeks. Nora, Charlie? That's a great story. Really, I think it's, you know, <laughs> just kind of a fact. <laughs> Touche. It is a great story. <laughs> Elaine, thank you. It's